Assalamu alaikum friends in this video i am going to share with you past paper of early childhood teacher test conducted by sts sakhar in 2018 let's start mcqs of part 3 pedagogy assessment rec question 21 learning about calendars in early years best promote among young children mathematical understanding is a learning about calendars in early years best promote among young children answer is mathematical understanding question 22 expecting young children to recognize and differentiate between colors is one of the learning outcome refer to which of the learning areas in the national curriculum for ec basic mathematical concepts expecting young children to recognize and differentiate between colors answer is basic mathematical concepts question 23 parent rich environment in early years classroom help young children to parent rich environment in early year classrooms help young children to read and understand that all these words have meaning question 24 which of the curriculum model has influenced pakistan as a national curriculum for early childhood education high scope curriculum model has influenced pakistan as a national curriculum for early childhood education answer high scope question 25 What does early literacy refers to? Early literacy refers to how children know about reading and writing before they actually begin to read and write. Question 26. If a group of 4 year old children who have not yet learned to read or write are asked to write something on a paper Which of the following describes what majority of these children in the group would most likely to do? Majority of these children in this group would likely to create scribbles that resemble the writing system to which they have been exposed. Question 27. Cognitive development in early years refers to the development of intellectual and mental capacities of young children question 28 which are the most recommended ways mentioned in the national curriculum for ece to access young children is performance in the class portfolio and checklist of children progress are the most recommended way mentioned in the national curriculum for ece to access young children is performance in the class right answer portfolio and checklist of children is progress question 29 in early years young children develop confidence curiosity self control ability to cooperate and communicate all these are the components of emotional intelligence right answer emotional intelligence question 30 Globally expected age parameter for early childhood education is birth to 8 years. Right answer birth to 8 years. Question 31. The learning outcomes in the National Curriculum 2007 for early childhood education are called expected learning outcomes because young children may achieve these learning outcomes at their own pace. Right answer is young children may achieve these learning outcomes at their own pace. Question 32. This approach towards learning allows you to build your knowledge on your prior knowledge. Constructivism is the approach towards learning allows you to build your knowledge on your prior knowledge. Right answer constructivist. Question 33. What are the constructivist theories for learning? The constructivist theory of learning allows you to build your knowledge on your prior knowledge. Question 34. A collective content activities and assessment in any branch of study. A collective contents activities and assessment in any branch of study is the textbook. Right answer textbook. Question 35. What are the student learning outcomes? Student learning outcomes are detailed statements describing what students are supposed to learn 
and able to do at each grade. Question 36. What are the colloquium standards? Colloquium standards are general statements that describe what students are expected to know and be able to do. Question 37. What is progressive education? Progressive education is an individualized approach to education that focuses more on the student's interest. Question 38. What is zone of proximal development? Zone of proximal development is the difference between what a child can do on their own and what they can do with the help of a more knowledgeable other. Question 39. Benjamin Blom developed which of the following? Benjamin Blom developed a taxonomy of cognitive processing based on hierarchy. Question 40. What is formative assessment? Formative assessment is considered as a way of assessing during teaching and learning process for feedback into teaching and learning process.